<laughs> yo, welcome to Sports Life and Hip Hop. Once again, yo, all our thousands and thousands of listeners. Once again, is this the first joint? Hmm? Is this the first joint, the second one? Well, I mean, you know. It's the reboot. It's the uh, reboot, right, right, right. No, all our thousands and thousands of listeners, you know what I'm saying, from SoundCloud. Thank you for coming over to YouTube with us, you know what I'm saying? It's once again, I got my man Zeke, got my man Ricky Sweet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Channel 7, man. Um, any comments, you know what I'm saying, anything you want us to discuss, any disses, any, you know what I'm saying, any props, whatever you want to give us, you know what I'm saying, leave them down there in the comments, you know what I'm saying. You can also hit us, hit us on IG, you know what I'm saying, in the DMs. Uh, this is won't happen every episode. I'm just giving you the disclaimers. <laughs> um, if we tend to get off in our, our sports bag, and you're not, that's kind of our bag. That's what we do. If real, we really fuck with sports, man. Like if you're not a sports head, don't trip. We will not alienate you. Just alienate you. Just, 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 just fast forward. Just slide it over. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We will get into the life of hip hop shit. Like, like we real, this guy right here, like T fucks with. Uh, fucking, yo, what's fucking Danny Greer's, uh, uh, uh fucking, uh, he just got rates officials, like, <laughs> what's, what's, what's his name, what's his name, Danny Green, Danny no, Green, not Danny Green, Danny no, Green. Danny Green. Greer, Greer. Greer. Uh, official, you know, the official, man, the one that retired, man, I'm trying to think of his name, who's the top rated official right now, who's the best fucking, top, Who's the t- best official? That's current. Respect. Probably the probably cat look like Gucci Man, whatever his name. Is. <laughs> Man, what is that dude's name? He wow. used to uh, ref my pops at the post office league. We're talking about NBA officials. That's how I'm looking. <laughs> this guy. You can throw any name out there. He'll give you the college, almost possibly man. the high school. Glad that the guy. <laughs> almost. Who? Wiz, 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 Wiz. Luke Walk, you, give me you've been stumped. Arizona man. How's uh, yeah, you? <laughs> let me give me, uh, let me give me, uh, <clears throat> give me Devonte Graham. Oh Kansas. Mm, see, <laughs> yeah, and there we go, man. And we really sports is, and I fucking, I go to sleep with an ear. LeBron problem. James. He didn't go to college. No. <laughs> hey, I go to sleep with an ear pod in my ear, man. I listen to fucking Jackie McMullen, Brown, <laughs> Ed, Ward, Ed Werner. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's all I fucking listen to. You know what I'm saying? Fucking. Dips. Yo, but, but we won't it. alienate you. If you're not a sports fan, don't trip. You know what I'm saying? But, but get into it. Let's get into it, man. The what hottest topic, topic in the NBA right now is what? Like, Luca being the coldest 20 year old? And it's not true. In history. Nah, it ain't true. Statistically. <laughs> Statistically, yeah. right, yeah. But yeah. Kobe was better than him at 20. And Kobe got right. his props, right? Nah, but I feel like Lou Greer is the, like, oh, he's the best ever. And, like, from a from a statistical standpoint, yeah, but I test, nah. Like, Kobe is better. Because he's not athletic. KG is better. Huh? Because he's not athletic. He's not dunking. He ain't right, I'm... I'm I kind of question that, bro. Huh? I, I fucks with Luca, bro. I didn't say you shouldn't fuck. I said from my eye test, he's not better than Kobe at twenty. No. You just said statistically he was. He is. Kobe at twenty wasn't Kobe at twenty three. Yeah, that's true. You know what I'm saying? As, as he got better, that fucking his progress was that fucking like like like. Is he better? Than, is he even better than KG at twenty? No. I mean, the way this guy <laughs> controls the game, like, you, KG is a, it's a different position, right? It's a new NBA. Yeah, I yeah, agree that. All right. Nah. Bloviated numbers, stats, I agree. Will he ever be MVP? Yeah. Mm-hmm. He's What's Ang- the issue? He's Anglo-Saxon. Well, I mean, no <laughs> issue. He's Anglo-Saxon. That's what, oh, that, that's, what, that's what's going to give him the vote, uh, this Dude, right here? He's, he, no, he got a whole country behind him. Dead ass. Oh, uh, that's yeah. true. That yeah. Uh, all stars. Yeah. You got star all votes. All that shit. Where's Where he right? from? The Slovenia. Slovenia. Just say Europe. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so well, I know. Uh, what you call this from uh, Latvia? Uh, Porzingis. Hmm. And they supposed to be. I don't think he's from the same place though. I, don't think I will say that's part. one of the fair trades of all time that Trey Young for Luca. Mm. Yeah, actually, people was that's that's that trade, trade at first. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Both both parties got. You know what I'm saying? Definitely got uh, decent players. So, but um, along with basketball, shout out to Vince Carter who played four decades in the NBA. 
Um, it's fucking crazy. Vince Carter is probably Wait. a top <laughs> 30 player. That we've seen in our life. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. In our lifetime, time, yeah. yeah in our oh, wait, our lifetime? In our lifetime? I'm going odd in that. Yeah, he might be 20. Like, all time? <laughs> I thought you meant, like, in just all time. Yeah, but our lifetime? Even though he gave up on his team and quit. Well, he, was, he, he went to fucking graduate. He had a yeah. game. You know he couldn't get his degree. Some people was upset wow. with him. Wow. He, he may lose his skill. He will never lose that knowledge. <laughs> <laughs> You was mad at that, uh... No, I wasn't mad at that, but people say later on with the Raptors, he kind of, like, gave up because he wanted to... Remember, he wanted to get out of there. No, I actually have a problem. I do have a problem with that. With him going to graduate? It's not like he wasn't going to graduate. He, you know what I'm saying? It was just the <laughs> he ceremony. He wanted to walk across the stage. Fuck that, bro. You in the playoff. It was a playoff <laughs> game, right? Yeah, it seven was. At that. F- it was game fucking seven. Hey, in his defense, he said he talked to his teammates and they was cool with it. Fuck <laughs> that, bro. You're the best player on a playoff team game seven. So if this Philly, so if this who was that? Philly. That was if Philly. If this Carter comes to you, like, hey, man. I want to go walk across the stage. It's my mom's dream. I'm gonna be back for the game, though. You go. What would you think of that, teammate? Bro, you on some whole shit. <laughs> bro, you on some whole shit, man. Hey, wait, hold up. You still gonna graduate? You still actually gonna get your diploma, though, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you on some whole shit. Bro. <laughs> Playoffs, man. That's bigger than that. This is mom's. His, can, his mom can't see him walk across the stage, huh? Bro, it's a commitment that comes with with the with the fame, fortune, the yeah, money you get. True. I didn't you know think about that. He is still gonna get his diploma. You're still getting your diploma, bro. Like when you ever do retire, you you, you know what I'm saying. You still have your diploma to like. Yeah, look like it, it, but his stats that game, like he definitely was a ball. That's the game where he missed a shot, though. Right? Yeah, but he still was Vince Carter. Like that didn't have nothing to do with he it. Ain't go, he ain't go to graduation. He might hit that shot. Uh, it was a lack of focus. We don't know. He would have hit. We, nah. we don't know, man. It's a game. By the way, that Philly team was trash. <laughs> yeah, it was all a- carried carry by the goat Iverson. The Iverson is not the GOAT. He's not the He's GOAT. one of them. No, he's like a top 30 player. Dude, <laughs> you just said Vince was top 30. Vince never was MVP. No, Iverson only Was Vince there. All-Star Game MVP? No. No, Iverson's better. Iverson is, is, he's top, he's not even the fifth, he's not even the fifth, you know, fourth best shooting guard ever. He top 10. What, a shooting guard? Yeah. A shooting guard, yeah, easily. But he's not a top 10 player. What was Vince Carter in natural position? Small four? Three. It's SFs, two. I mean, we he's a swing guard. Yeah. yeah. He used a two? Yeah, he used a two, three. Oh, okay. He used a two. Did T Mac start in Toronto? Of course, yeah. So yeah, he was a two then. Because T Mac was, was a two. three. Yeah. I mean. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. Point sure. is that he could have walked across the stage. He still gave. He still was killing that game. I think AI has more accolades than Vince. No, he does. I'm not. Yeah, I think, yeah, I, right, I think AI. What's the argument here? No, AI <laughs> is better than Vince. No, I was just. Thank you. You know, because I know you. You like love AI. You get. You try to shit on them every chance you get. Where did Vince? Oh, go? I, I, I got. I got to shit on a 41% field goal percentage <laughs> guy <laughs> who shot 13 for 33 in a game. I got shit on that. It's not hard. This only an eight-time All-Star, man. Come on. Eight-time All-Star. <laughs> you know how crazy an eight-time All-Star. Right. That's not Allen easy. Iverson, eleven times. That's because most of them was fan votes from like Justin Bieber <laughs> votes and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like that's not like reserves. Yeah. What college did Vince Carter go to? North Carolina. Come on, man. Oh, man. Come on, dude. Him and Jameson. Just they got traded for each other. Testing your skills. They got traded for each other. But yo, like Vince Carter, shout out to him for doing uh, four decades. Yeah, salute. Yeah. He did He did four decades of basketball. And he's like playing real ball. Vince Carter yeah, is still yeah. playing like, like solid ball. And like, he's respected. Vince Carter player, is about right. to be 43 years old and in January 26. Open. And he still will bust your ass at export. Oh, he's 6'7", so yeah. No, he'll bust anybody ass. Anymore. There's no player in the NBA that won't bust ass at export. Some that won't. Wow. Name one. Name one. Dude, we brought this up numerous <laughs> times. I will score on Cameron Payne, man. <laughs> You're not scoring on Cameron. Isaiah Thomas. You know, do you know what Cameron? Do you know what Cameron Payne would do in export, dog? 
He be killing, no doubt. I'm, I'm just saying I was school. I mean, like, it's beyond killing, though. Like, <laughs> you, 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 you saw what Cameron Payne. Uh, so if I go up, year if, old if Cameron Payne is an ex I'm be like, oh, my God, yo. Yes. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> I don't think so. He should be what? Yeah. That nigga should be in the NBA. I don't, think I'd be, I don't think I'd be going that crazy with Cameron Payne at export. Yeah, yeah. IT, probably. You IT crazy. is a better player than him. If Shumper came up to export, you would go crazy. Shumper's a better player than Cameron Payne. Shumper's not in the NBA. If Joe Cameron Harris, Payne ain't either. If Joe Harris came to, to export, you would kill him. He would fucking <laughs> Joe he Harris, be pulling yeah. up at half court. You, you name people better than Cameron Payne. Virginia, by the way. Mm. Joe Harris. Big oh. five. I'm not even looking at mm-hmm. <laughs> Looking at stats. Where did Cameron Payne go? Uh, he went to um, some butt fuck university. Um, See, you don't know everybody. That's easy. Campaign went to. Uh, not anyway, mo- moving on. No, nah, give me a second, dude. <laughs> Man. He's supposed to come to you. Pause. Not Appalachian State. I don't know who went, who went there. Murray State. Murray State. Mm. Mm. Murray State. Take Some off brandness. Dude, I mean, you. you no, somebody me. else went there too, right? Somebody else notable went there. No. <laughs> I'm going on a tangent. Hey, what's up with Rob Polinko, man? Like. Like, what does this dude, like, like learn, like, you know what I'm saying, player morale counts, like, you know what I'm saying, like, last year he put it publicly every, the whole team is on the block, except LeBron, now he, he just, did that again, he right? just did it, he said, everybody's on the block except AD and LeBron, like, you know what I'm saying? I think at this point, Kyle Kuzma is probably playing for uh, another team. You know what I'm saying? Like, he's playing to prove to another team. Like I don't think they're going to make a trade, though. Nah. Rumor has a Devin Booker, man. No, I, they I can't don't afford think so. This is per... Uh, to get that book, book your house. You, you do know the uh, contracts kind of match. Oh, yeah. Definitely. I mean, trust me, they got the assets. <clears throat> They, they don't. Got they don't it's think not going to be a head up Kyle Kuzma for a fucking uh, Devin Booker. I don't think they need Booker though. They I think they do. What's their record? I don't think they only got they like need five a losses. Punch. Hmm? I don't think they only got no, like no, five losses. Their record is like seventeen and zero versus under five, teams below five hundred. Oh, okay. You know what I'm saying? Like it's kind of a bloated stat. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. They, 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 their stat, their record is kind of bloated. bloated. You know what I'm saying? I, when, when, when Brian isn't on there, their team is 100% different. Even when AD is on the, on the court. So no, that second half no, of the season, they said when LeBron isn't on the, on the team, that even yeah. when AD is on the court. I mean, but LeBron is it stirs everything up. I'm saying, they, you know what I'm saying? There's no one that could get their own bucket. It was supposed to be Kyle Korver, but for, I mean, not Kyle Korver, but Kuzma. Kuzma. He, I mean, maybe, you know, he is coming off an injury. Maybe it is, like, t- him trying to get in where he fit in, but it's, you know what I'm saying? They, they need a scoring punch, you know what I'm saying? Like, <clears throat> I've, the, the scoring loaders, they need that third option, you know what I'm saying? Avery Bradley. Danny Gray. <laughs> These are all role players that that's... KCP. They, they, all their scoring is based off KCP. LeBron. All based off LeBron. Yeah, they ain't getting their own shot. Kickoffs from AD. That's why they're gonna get Darren Collison. So, oh yeah, they trying. They might. I heard he's back, right? right? Did he did he come back to Indiana or no? Nah, was he a free agent? No, he's not going to Indiana. Oh shit! You hope he's with us, by the way. Oh yeah, that's right. He quit. <laughs> he got another lawyer, <laughs> cat. <laughs> yeah, that's why he quit, right? For his mm-hmm. religion. Yeah. Well, I heard uh, the Clippers might try to get him just to keep him from the Lakers, because they know the Lakers mm. supposedly need a guard. Yeah, that's definitely a chess match Rondo. for Rondo. Rondo is valuable to me. Yeah. Rondo. You know what I'm saying? Like, super, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, his, his stats really don't, like, tell a story of what he brings to the team. Like, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? Veteran leadership, throwing all his cliches. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, nah, he go. He, he brings his hard hat in his lunch pail. <laughs> 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 all right. Shit, a lot man. of grit. What did y'all think about the uh, the KD versus Kendrick Perkins beef? Um, it's a bunch of nonsense. Yeah, it's, it's, uh, Kendrick had some points as well as KD, but 
You think it's real beef on sight when they see each other? No. 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 I, I mean, you know, there's beefing with each other. Kendrick took a low shot, you know what I'm saying, on, on, on you know what I'm saying, saying that um, Westbrook was the greatest Thunder ever. Blatant shot at, 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 at KD. <laughs> he might be the greatest ever. Do the year. I mean, it's arguable. I, if any of you, I, I wouldn't say you're fucking out of your mind if you yeah. think Russell Westbrook is the greatest yeah. Thunder. But at the same time, you know what I'm saying? It was, you know what I'm saying? It was a bit of a hyperbole going on. You know what I'm saying? It was Russell Westbrook's first night. You know what I'm saying? Back in OKC, healthy. You know what I'm saying? And playing. You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, you know what I'm saying? KD went low, saying <laughs> our big man averaged a whopping two and three. You know what I'm saying? Like. Way to go, champ. You know what I'm saying? So it, now it became a pissing contest. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's fucking Twitter. Well, it was a Twitter, right? Yeah. yeah it's uh-huh. Twitter, man. I don't really Dan think Perk about brought it shit. back up on uh, the jump. Mm, I saw that. Uh, and that's kind of, becomes, uh, kind, of, kind of becomes Kendrick's reinvention. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He's, he kind of a, he's, he's a Twitter figure now. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? He's a, he's a, yeah, he's a decent saying? analyst, though. Yeah, he's, he's an interesting follow, too. Yeah. Yeah. Follow, yeah. Too. yeah. I don't, think you should, I don't think you're gonna do no play by play on the game or nothing, but nah. Right. Y'all vote for All Star yet? No. No, I don't vote. I don't vote, I don't vote for the fucking United States of America. You think I vote for fucking like NBA? The last time I voted for All Star was the punch out cards. They used to have it. Oh yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah, I used to. That's the last time I voted. I used I used to vote on. That was probably like in the nineties. Hey, you just dated yourself. Hey man, I am who I am. Fuck these young niggas. Damn. <laughs> I'm just kidding. A lot of young niggas. Pause. Pause. <laughs> <laughs> no, but the NBA this year has been mad uh, competitive. Utah Jazz on the 10 game winning streak got uh, Jordan Clarkson. Mm-hmm. Uh, I like that. That's without Mike Conley. Mike Conley's out, you know, for the next couple of weeks. You got. Um, what happened? He hurt? Yeah, he's hurt. Um, oh. I forgot the type of injury. Uh, you got the Lakers. I think the Bucks are going to go to the finals. I Whoa, have... bold prediction. Right, right. Well, <laughs> I'm going out on a limb here. Bucks are going to the finals. Yeah. But I think the Bucks, and I think I think uh, America will see Lakers and Bucks. But I think uh, Bar like as of today, was it January 15th? We're in January mm-hmm. 16th. Uh, barring any trade, um, major trade, I think. The Clippers could beat the Lakers. Definitely. Yeah. So I think as of down, now, like yeah. Clippers and, and Bucks, but I think the I think the Lakers are gonna make a trade somehow where Kevin Love will get on the Lakers. I don't know. He's how, on the block. He's definitely, he's definitely on the block. He's on the block, but I don't know how they make it happen, but I feel <clears> like <throat> Kevin Love will be. Do y'all think Kevin Love is out of yeah, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. He just got into it with uh, what you call it, um, the GM, shouting match yeah. in practice. Oh, yeah, 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 you know what I'm saying? He's, he's the, him, Andre he's Drummond, him, Andre Drummond, and uh, and uh, Kyle Kuzma are like the hottest three uh, cats on the trading block right now. You think Kuzma gone? I don't know. I don't, I, I don't is so if fucking. Like, he's unreadable and unpredictable, man. Like, you know, should he be done? They don't really, I don't think they really need a trade, but when you're playing with LeBron, you know, you could. Yeah, you no, could they need a trade, dude. No, they, they, need they, a need, they need, they need, they need, they need one more score. Yeah. One sure. more facilitator. One more person that can create his own shot. They have nobody create. If you think about the second unit, they yeah, have nobody create. So they need a, another guy to come off the bench? Like if you had, yeah, like if you had a, uh, if you had a, and this is extraordinary, like this is high end. If you had a Crawford type on the second unit, yeah, but you need the equivalent of Lou Crawford. Williams. You need a Lou yeah, Williams. like a Lou oh, Williams. Yeah, yeah, someone like that. Create their own shot, can mm-hmm. score, facilitate, yada yada. Because the only team you only got Bron and Ronald that can only make shots for everyone else. Those are the only two players. Mm-hmm. Like I don't trust Quick yeah. Cook. I don't trust Kuzma. I don't trust KCP. Like none of those dudes can create no. shots for others. But Rondo and and LeBron are the only two that can create. Speaking of Quinn Cook, is uh, Sports Life and Hip Hop going to summer league this year? <laughs> yeah, for sure. Yo, remember yeah. Quinn Cook? Yo, that nigga had like fucking a shirt, some flip flops, some shorts, with that shit on his wrist. 
<laughs> yo, <laughs> yo, that nigga, you can see that shit a block away. You know what I'm saying? We going, we doing some, uh, we doing some a little bit. I would like to. It shouldn't be as packed as it was. No, I would. No Zion. Yeah. Uh, Mello will be there. Mm. From Anthony. No, Lamelo. Yeah. Hey, oh, if Cole he Anthony is, come yeah, out yeah, too. Cole Anthony. Cole Anthony. If Cole Anthony, Anthony come out, I still don't think it's yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, it's yeah, won't be the Zion high. It like, was selling out for the. He supposed to be playing time. Thursday. I'm yeah, he's coming back. Next Thursday, he supposed to play, right? Yeah, he look out of shape. But it's gonna be a fucking Next ESPN. Up. All of all the. Oh yeah, they ready for for five minutes of play. You know what I'm saying? They're like, no, he get more than five minutes. Slow management. I sit. Well, yeah, I'm just. I'm, He'll get uh, an actual uh, 23. NBA TV is like we're gonna have every basket. <laughs> every basket is right, gonna right. be shown on here. <laughs> they ready for him? Get they ready for him? He'll get 23 back. minutes. That's why they got all them TV gangs. They thought he was gonna be playing. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. I want to see him come back though. I want to yeah. see what he got. Pause. <laughs> <laughs> what you call it? Um. Well, the biggest shit we're going on right now, I guess, would be the baseball cheating scandal. Yeah. Like, that's fucking bananas, man. Like, but baseball is known for cheating. That's a horrible segue. <laughs> <laughs> How the yeah. fuck? Horrible segue. I, I'm just saying, like, it's the biggest shit popping. Like, the guy, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, like baseball is known Technology. For like, yeah. no, no, no. It's known for cheating, but this is the first time whistling, like, so you got Technology ju- included. You got juice balls. Spence the science killer. You got juice balls, pause. You mm-hmm. got uh, you got uh, spit balls, pause. <laughs> you got uh, cork bats. You got uh, steroids. Steroid PEDs. You have uh, what else they do? Like, Gambling. They, they got pine tar on a bat. Like baseball is known for. Like, it's kind of part, part, part of the game, like do? almost. Yeah, like, it's part of the game. That's but awesome. technology that no one else has access to. Everybody can can st- steal signs from the dugout. And, yeah. and w- uh-huh. This is the first time with technology, like you know what I'm saying. Like uh, who was that? Uh, uh, ball. I want to say that was the Yankees. When they fucking, they were like unreal at home. And they fucking go to Houston and they camp. Like, it was just like a night and day. They were a totally different team all of a sudden. That's when Houston That's fucking stole yeah. signs, yeah. The technology, mm. you know what I'm saying? It wasn't just them stealing signs. Like, everybody had, you know what I'm saying? Okay, they're better at stealing signs than the Yankees. No. Mm-hmm. They have technology that the Yankees don't have. If everybody had the technology, okay. You know what I'm saying? It's fair game. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, <clears throat> it's tripped out to me because it's like, you know what I'm saying? My thing is like, and I'm not the biggest baseball guy. No. Let that be known. No. We're not, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> For years. Who the really fuck cares about baseball? But, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, fucking, uh, who's this, what's this dude? Um, fucking Pete Rose is banned. <laughs> for life, for fucking baseball, for gambling. These niggas actually cheated. Like, you know what I'm saying? With technology, like, you know what I'm saying? It was like banging cans or some shit yeah. with a curveball. Wow. Like, that type banging of shit. <laughs> yeah. You about to throw a curveball. <laughs> Crack! You know, they uh. throw this shit out the park. Man, let Pete Rose back, man. Charlie <laughs> Hustle, man. Well, they taking the, uh,. What they what they do? They take their draft pick. They're not taking the title back, are they? No, nah, I yeah. think they should. Give them to Michigan. There was no yeah, I never Fab heard. Five. I never heard of Fab Five. <laughs> I told Isaiah, I told Zeke that I never heard of Fab Five. No, but it happened though. It didn't happen. Did it? Yes, it did. It didn't happen. Just, show me the record books where that shit happened. Right. I can show you the documentary. <laughs> no, I, I never heard of. I never heard 30. of Derrick Rose. Derrick Rose in Memphis. Mm-hmm. Oh, come on, man. I never heard of Derrick Rose. You can't erase something from everybody's memory. Man, they just did. Okay. Speaking of men, 30 men in 30. black. <laughs> 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 what the fuck just happened? All right, they definitely did that to him. Like, they definitely vacated uh, Derrick Rose and they definitely vacated Fat Five. So there was no Fat Five. There was no Fat Five. There was no Fat Five. It's nothing on the books. Nothing. So knowing what pitch is coming. Greatly increases your chances yeah, that much. Yeah, it's not real talk. It does. On that level. On that level, yeah, it does. If you know that a fastball is coming, I can prepare for a fastball. Yeah. If you know that a curveball is coming, I'm like, yo, like I'm ready for that shit. 
Because you still got to hit the ball, though. That don't mean you're going to hit the ball you know, if you go pitches coming. Them dudes are exceptionally good. You know, I, they say, do you believe that? They say the, uh, hitting a, a, a major league uh, uh, ball was the hardest, toughest thing in sports? Yes. <laughs> I, I do too. I, I never respect played, their talent. I yes. never played baseball at any high level, so I wouldn't really know. I would assume that it's, yeah, it's very hard. difficult. It's hard as fuck, pause. What would that pause worthy? I said hard as fuck, pause. Mm. <laughs> Definitely pause worthy. Pause so, granted. So the cheat this cheating, what would it be equivalent to in the NBA? Is there oh, okay. an equivalent? To, to nigga shit, like, cause you only know basketball. <laughs> Um, the refs, yeah, some people refs cheat. Everybody don't watch ba- uh, baseball. Okay, so knowing someone's sign is like when when Russell Westbrook. That's you, not like knowing a play that's coming in basketball, right? Yeah, it is. It's like I know they're going to run pick and roll. So LeBron I'm, knows other teams' plays. Uh, it's but, like having but, a sixth guy on the, on the court. That's what it's like? Yeah. Uh... Right. Because if you say, because we all and we're know, talking in cheating, the NBA, though. if we all in the NBA, we all know a PR is coming at some point in time. In the right, game. people holler out pick. Oh, but pick I'm saying, but uh, a six man on the court is going to get called by a ref. I would, I would consider it more. Um, <clears throat> I would, I would compare I'm it more like, to like what type of advantage would it be? I would, I would. The advantage to me would be. Fucking uh, Houston having one of the players that they just traded to have in Portland's handbook. You know what I'm saying? Team playbook. You know what I'm saying? They got traded to Houston. Now they, they got all of Houston's plays. You know what I'm saying? It's some sneaky, underhanded shit. You know what I'm saying? That's what the cheating that, that Houston did was some sneaky, underhanded shit. Right. Everybody knows they cheat. Everybody knows that we steal signs. We try, but having technology. Nah, right. was the you bullshit. know what? In the NBA, I think it's different because, like, in the NBA, we all know their players. Everybody runs the, the same play. But they're specialty plays. Nah, everybody don't run the same. Everybody runs the same play in the NBA. PR. Yeah, yeah. If yeah. you run I mean, a PR, space and pace, space and pace, uh, uh, two two man game or spread out to post high high low. You know what I'm saying? NBA is like you don't, you can know their plays all the way, but like. You gotta stop them. You gotta stop them. Yeah. Like, that's the thing about stopping them. It's like having a six guy on the court in the NBA, I would say. And but a six it's, player it's on unlikely. the court is gonna get called. You know what I'm saying? A ref is gonna see that, get your stupid ass on the court as a technical foul. You know what right, I'm, I'm saying? not saying, you know saying? Like, uh, yeah, literally. Yeah, yeah, this is something that got away. Houston yeah, got that's, that's away. True. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's not a play in the NBA. I would say, you know what? This is where you tell our, our thousands and thousands of listeners and followers. Yo, like, what is it that is equivalent to? But I think that um, it's not a play because the NBA is mad different. I would say it's like it's like having someone in the NBA. It's like having. Well, maybe you can't compare it to the NBA. Maybe it's the NFL. Yeah, maybe the NFL, NFL playbook. Yeah, no, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Having the NFL. NBA, no, it don't work. In the NFL, yeah. Yeah, if you know the other teams plays in the NFL, you can. Actually, it's been it's documented. Built fucking Belichick. You know what I'm saying? The Patriots have been actually oh, yeah, fine for cheating. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, that's pretty crazy, man. Speaking so you, of NFL, you think the uh, think to go back to baseball, you think the player should be uh, uh, reprimanded? Yeah, reprimanded. No, because they get what Only they got. The owner, the GM, right. And players were complicit in this shit. Right, so like I said, someone was know. banging the cans. <laughs> <laughs> the players were com- complicit yeah, in this shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, but it's like to me, it's like it's needle in the haystack type shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, how do you really, you know what I'm saying? How do you really find out who was complicit and who wasn't? And if everybody was complicit on that team, you know, and they didn't do it for just one season, right? When they no, nah. no, nah, it was multiple. Yeah. So, Man. speaking of NFL, though, <laughs> fuck you, y'all see this shit with AB? What the, <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with this dude, man? Hey, man. Hey, man. He might get CTE, man. I've, he got mental health issues, bro. And does does he come back in the league? No. You think he's going to I can't. I really Never. can't see it. Nah, no, I can't see it. Has, is this unprecedented? He just got a tryout, though, didn't he? Was, and he blew it. Oh, and he said it was a publicity stunt. <laughs> <laughs> the nigga was so good in his tryout. He caught him. What you talking about? New Orleans? Or you talking about uh, New Orleans? Pay, okay, all right. New Orleans. I was say in his brief stint and fucking the, with the Patriots, he caught a fucking touchdown. That's how good. Is this unprecedented? Like with the Patriots, he he was killing. He caught a fucking touchdown, dog. 
Yeah. I don't get that shit, man. Like, all he had to do was shut the fuck up for like two, three days, <laughs> and his money was guaranteed with, with yeah. Oakland. You know what I'm saying? Or LA. They, they still in, in, still in Vegas. They're in Vegas now. They'll be in Vegas next year. All he had to do was shut the fuck He couldn't do it. You know what I'm saying? He has mental health issues. Now he's fucking taping himself, denigrating the cops of, of, of Florida in front of his kids. Why does everything happen in Florida? But he's, a, he's, a, he's a rapper too now. Now yeah, he's MC. Yeah. yeah. He put a, did he put about. a video out? Antonio Brown. Something rapper. like that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah man. He a rapper. Are you surprised? He got some song out. Antonio Brown a rapper. Yeah. Rapper. They play it on they play the snippet on Joe Budden pod. <laughs> He, he sound what? It was pretty it's bad. trash. Yeah, I forgot what I forgot what it's called. It wasn't it wasn't good. Not like, like money, really man. Good. It wasn't like Allen Iris and Forty Bars. No, I didn't, I didn't want to. Or Chris Webber or Ron <laughs> Why do <laughs> athletes need to feel the needs of rappers? Rappers want to be ballers. Damn ballers want to be rappers, hey, man. Lilith can spit. Hey, low key, Dana Barrels was decent. Low key, Shaq was decent. Shaq, was Shaq decent. is probably the best rapper. Shaq, Shaq is probably the best rapper. Followed closely by Iverson, Forty Bars. No, mm, no. Forty Iverson Bars was, was hard. Trash. <laughs> like, don't, don't disrespect. Nah, the guy. don't. Nah, yeah, I'm disrespecting the guy. Like. Can't do that, man. His vibe was cold though. It was His vibe was good. Yeah. It was straight. That shit was trash though. He was, he was dissing the gays. <laughs> yeah. That's why I didn't want to come out. A lot of homophobia, out. right? Yeah. <laughs> Yo, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. <laughs> we got Iran missile strikes. We got we got cheating in baseball. We got A B. Fuck all that. There's been a new WNBA CBA agreement. Oh yeah, yeah. I didn't think this was where you were going. Yo, shout out the women, man. <laughs> I did not think this was where you were going, but okay. I didn't know. You- <laughs> Who the fuck cares about the fucking WNBA? <laughs> <laughs> Who the fuck really cares about the WNBA? Hey, I ain't know you was going to do Yo, yeah, it was cats be bad. killing me, man, but like, with the political correctness shit, man. Like, nobody cares about the WNBA. You're not happy for them? I'm happy for them. I'm oh, definitely. Right. I heard they got more, uh, what do you call that? More uh, money, man. Yeah. More money. But, uh, but not only that, but they got more... Um, like uh, like guaranteed leave. I heard they like when they got pregnant. Like they had to like that was unpaid time off. Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah. What the fuck kind of sla- China slavery? <laughs> like slave labor yeah. is this shit? Like and a lot of yeah, them. Had, a lot them. of them had to play overseas. They had to yeah, play. They overseas needed jobs like in the summer to work at a Kingo's to make ends meet. <laughs> <laughs> But at the same time, who fucking cares about the? I, yo, I'm actually, I'm actually entertained when I watch the WNBA. But it's like, I'm trying to pull up the. It's still exact like specifics of their deal. Until one of them motherfuckers start trip three sixties, doing three sixties and shit, like. And y'all, we didn't we discuss that? Like, why, why is it no chicks? That's is it ever gonna be a chick that's like, a- athletic as LeBron or close to? Nah, it probably won't be. Just because they're female, it's not. And let it, hey, and let it be known, I know the worst WNBA player, NBA player, will bust my fucking ass. <laughs> Isaiah don't, Zeke don't think that. Uh, wow. I'll we'll probably score on him. You chauvinistic piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> but he also said. I just said I was scoring on IT though. Yeah. He's at that time, t- hey, ladies, take no offense. He also feels he can get what? How many points you gonna score on AI? AI. Ow. Right now? Right now. Uh, all right, right now. Up up to five. I'm scoring at least three. J- JJ Habaha. Oh, I might beat him. <laughs> wow. You might beat him? Yes. Dude. I'd be, I'd be <laughs> comfortable putting money on that. Wow. You bugging. You bugging. I'm bigger than him. I'm stronger than him. Pause. Longer than him. You think you, oh. you, think you, <laughs> Pause. you think you're stronger than JJ? Yes. No. Yes. A Baja or Abreu? Nah, I said Abreu. JJ um, Baja. Uh, um, I think I'm pronouncing the name wrong, but. What's the buddy from uh, from Dallas? I said that. Puerto Borico. JJ Barrea. JJ Barrea. Oh, Barrea, yeah, yeah. You ain't beating JJ. Do you know how fast his first step is? Exactly. Back up off of him. Do you know he'll hit? Oh, he light you up. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Are you playing keeps? 
Nah. It don't matter. <laughs> <laughs> ain't going to miss it. Exactly. I might not miss either. I'm getting to the rim. He's not stopping me from getting to the rim. Man. Yes, he is. He's no. Bro, he's used to sticking six five, six six niggas on the regular. He's always the shortest to play on exactly. the court. He, he, he definitely... He definitely can't really do it. WNBA CBA. 30% salary cap increase. Mm -hmm. The max salary is 215000 up from 117000 Hey. Rookie <laughs> salary increased 25%. Uh, minimum prize money for special competition is k And 50 50 revenue share. Yeah, they wasn't, oh, that's, that's why they wasn't getting no money. That's what the revenue they, share. They got zero? It, it, no, they that's was getting. A, they were just getting a small percent. Okay. It was that's that's why they wasn't really getting them. Well, they wasn't really creating a lot of revenue anyway, but they still wasn't getting a, a decent share of that. That's why they wasn't getting a lot of money too. Because mm. NBA, they get a lot of re, a lot of the revenue. That's how they get a lot of their money. Right. That's and it was cool. something about uh, guaranteed uh, two bedroom housing for people with kids and all that. What? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, so they, they came up. Okay, well, salute to the WNBA. To the salute to We love you, ladies. <laughs> <laughs> she said. What else popping, man? Um, NFL playoffs? Nah, fuck that. Kanye ain't falling off his horse. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is up with hey, Kanye? Kanye my ass CTE, man. <laughs> I, I, I used to look, I, was, I used to look up to that guy. All right, no, I can ask. You, I, I, I can ask y'all, man. Like the rumor has it, this is a way out of his out of the title deal or the rock deal or some shit. Because mm -hmm. of falling off the horse? No, no, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> That's just some goof shit. That's some goof ass shit. Um, I, I, by, the, by the way, I watched I watched that shit like like. 21 times for real. Like, that shit was <laughs> hilarious. It's dude. fucking hilarious. Dude, dude, like, shit is and then the dancers, the praise dancers were still going at right, it. Like, they stayed in character. They stayed in character. Right. Like when he <laughs> fell off, they was like, yo, we still in. That was supposed to happen. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> five hours <laughs> right back in that five minutes. That's the same guy, yo. <laughs> yo, he did five hours later. I'll be there in five minutes. He did that run, yo. This nigga falling off horses. <laughs> well, this nigga did Yeezy ones and Nikes. And this nigga falling off horses. Dope, nigga. Well, what I'm hearing is like, I'm gonna act. I'm gonna act shocked, cause you, you know what I'm saying. Like, I'm going strictly off hearsay, so maybe y'all got some insight as to whether it's true or not. This was like being a gospel album. He put a whole album out mm -hmm. under the gospel title, so this is a way he can put it out under his own umbrella and title gets none of it. Or The Rock, whoever. Whoever, he don't mm -hmm. have to pay. I heard this is a way to get. So that's what he gonna do for the rest of his career? So I don't know if it, how many albums he was old. Or uh, whatever. So you yeah. think he gonna just release gospel to get out of that and go back? <laughs> it was a ploy. He did some May shit. I wouldn't. You know what? I was just about to ask y'all. Like, I don't know. This is, this is the rumors I'm hearing. You know what I'm saying? This is. I, I was gonna ask. Do y'all think we, he ever goes back to making no good music? No. No pun intended. No. I, I still can't. I, think of, I, I gotta. I gotta. Some of this shit on the gospel shit is decent. Follow God is hard, bro. I ain't gonna even lie. He got a couple of tracks on there. The beats was decent. Yeah, two tracks. I, I haven't gone two back tracks, to that album. But shit. I would if he went back and like yo yo I'm back making rap now God told me to I, <laughs> yeah, would, I, I wouldn't it. be shocked because he's done crazier his, stuff. His catalog and his track record is so sick. Any time that he decides to go back to that real shit, I'm there. You know what I'm saying? Whatever Kanye you know drops, I'm, I'm probably gonna listen. I'm gonna to check it out. I'm gonna give it a shot. Man, it's a rap. You think you you think you gonna get the. Uh, we probably ain't, getting, dropout we probably ain't getting Life of Pablo Kanye back. You're not even gonna get that Life of Pablo Kanye. Fuck. You ain't even getting him. Fuck. And you gonna get fucking 50 year old Kanye. Like, I got four kids. I don't think he gonna make gospel music for the rest no, of his no, career. No, 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 no. Nah, I don't quit. think that. I think he's done. But he said that though. College dropout is done. That's he said he's not making secular music anymore. Yeah, that's a wrap. I don't think, I'm, no, I don't I'm think saying, he gonna do that though. No, I'm saying like, um, College dropout, yeah, he's done. Oh yeah, that's big. Life of Pablo is done. That's done. Yeah. You won't get that no more. But I don't, gospel for the rest of his career, I, I don't see that. 
I'll probably think... still buy his sneakers though. You know what I'm saying? Nah. Like I'm. I would dump the sneakers when once he left Nike. Nah, I, I probably still buy the sneakers. Like, no, I'm, I'm a sneaker person, so. I tried to get the red Octobers, didn't work. Dude, yeah. You, 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 man, you sounded mad disappointed when you didn't get them. Yeah, I want to, I want to flip them. You know, how, <laughs> you know how hard it is for us to get to red Octobers. Hey, they came out. This was when shoes was coming out online. Everybody had a chance. No, nah, you ain't have a chance. I you thought, ain't never bought. I did. You ain't never bought. <laughs> you ain't never bought. But yo, I, you know, Kanye, I love him. I love his music, so to speak. I don't know the person, but I love his music, but uh, yeah, that's a wrap. Chicago nigga, man. So he might Chicago come back. Yeah. Is no. Kanye going to be at All Star Weekend? No. This but, is Chicago. Why wouldn't he be there? Uh, uh, no, he's more. Hey, Common Con, 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 will be there. Con, he's performing, Con, right? Yeah, Common. Con, 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 are you a Chaz fan? No. I mean, I'm not a Chaz fan, but I don't I like. I like his older works better. The okay. acid rap shit. Yeah. I don't disrespect. That's no disrespect to Chaz that I don't. I'm not a fan of. Him. I don't. I don't feel like he makes music for me. You know what I'm saying? Like he doesn't make music for a 40 year old. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> he loves. So his, he you loves know what I'm his saying? Wife. Right. What? You know what I'm saying? Yo, the whole album was based off. I his still haven't listened to his album, by the way. Who? James, that whole album, album was based off his wedding. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I still haven't listened to that. I fucks with the younger cats, man. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, you know, so I can tell Chance has a, some like his his skill. He's highly skilled. You know what I'm saying? If if, if yeah. he ever got like on some like someone like dissed him or something like, you know what I'm saying? He's witty. He can yeah. get on some shit. You know what I'm saying? He can, he can fuck somebody up. So is uh Shauna, Shauna gonna be there for all <laughs> Oh yeah, she definitely gonna be there. She gonna be there. We won't know. Is she performing? <laughs> you performing? No, no, she not performing. Maybe at a club or something. Dang, Shauna, Shauna can't spin. Shauna, Shauna, Shauna was calling right before like side. Bump J ain't gonna perform. Bump J definitely gonna be there. Bump gonna be there. He gonna perform. Shout out, shout out, uh, salute, uh, Bump. Huh? No, I'm saying like Chicago artists. I'm trying to. No, G Herbo not gonna be there. Crucial, Herbo gonna be there. Crucial conflict not gonna be there. Damn. Herbo gonna be there. Fucking Tessa gonna be there. Baby. FBG Duck. He gonna be there. Ooh. You Chicago niggas like who's popping, who's relevant right now. Uh, FBG Dirt. Duck. <laughs> FBG Duck is. Yo, he might be t- after Dirk and King Von. Is, King Von gonna be there. Is that Free Band? Hmm? He with Future? Is that FBG Free Band? <laughs> nah, man. What the fuck? Why, <laughs> <Fine>, yo? <laughs> <laughs> What's yo, the FBG for? That's, some, that's like gang gang shit, man. That's like. No, but Future shit is Free Band gang. I thought that was FBG. I don't wanna say Flyboy gang. I don't wanna disrespect no, the niggas. Like, yeah, that's some gang shit. But FBG Duck, he on some, he like one of the biggest artists out of Chicago. I heard that name before. I didn't know he was yeah. from Chicago. Though. Yeah, FBG Duck, FBG Butter, um, Dirt gonna be the. Um, yeah, he definitely gonna be there. I mean, whoever's anybody of anybody's gonna be at the All Star game this year. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? Who's the dopest, weakest link? You. Sheik. <laughs> you. Uh, we got Sheik. We got we got fucking Master Killer. Y'all agree with Master me? Master Killer. No. Who is it the weakest the weakest link in the Wu? You got? No. I will listen to Wu. You got. Fucking Master Killer doesn't rhyme, man. Master Killer does rhyme. Uh, I think you got that. He raps better than Master Killer's album. All right, all right. Whatever. I'm sure. Sheik is the weakest watch. Who's the weakest link out of Day Life Soul? I don't even know all the cats in De La Soul name. Wow. It's not I'm Pasta Noose. Pasta Noose. <laughs> <laughs> Pasta Noose. I ju- y'all just told me another cat named True Goy. <laughs> True Goy is the True Goy is probably the dopest. The only reason I am know this dude is I'm looking up. Maceo. Maceo? Maceo is probably Maceo. the weakest one. Right, 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 right. right. Dude, De I got like easily over 10 albums. 10 albums? Yup. And you're a hip hop historian. You're a historian. What you you love hip hop. Three you feet high and rising. Then my soul is dead. Balloon mind state. Stakes is high. Man, stakes is high. Artificial man. intelligence. Artificial intelligence. Bionics. This yeah. is when it probably started going down here. <laughs> the grind date. Bionics was hot. Bionics was hot. Bionics was hot. Yeah. Slept right, on. Oh one. Oh four. Grind date. 
plug one and plug two prevent first serve. <laughs> look, look, look. He gonna go draw a board. He gonna, he gonna try to shit on it. And, and, what, and, and the anonymous oh, nobody, 2016. I ain't heard this shit. Plug one. I'll probably go back and listen to it. Man. Plug one. Plug, plug two. two. Plug one. Hey, look. <clears throat> Shout out to Griselda, I'm going, man. I mean, you know what I'm saying? Y'all fucking with me, what? Yeah, we did. 28th, yeah. man, um, in what Chicago. Was, what was Shane gonna do tour? Yeah, I'm checking for that, <laughs> man. I hope they got merch. Yo, I hope y'all got merch, Griselda. Fuck like, yeah. Right, it's gonna be merch. I get it, though. I want merch. They, the fuck, the fuck, the fact that this shit is not so readily available is what makes it even doper, like, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. yeah salute to Griselda. You, you don't Griselda. have any, right? No. <laughs> You came on late, pause. I didn't, I just couldn't get it. I, I just, fucking this shit was gone. Shout out to Cobbs, he, he put me on the west side. Guys. Yeah, shout out wow. to Drake Cobbs, man. He put me on the, I cannot lie, he put me on the west side gun. Yeah. The whole Griselda shit. Uh, who put me on the west I think I did. I put no. Side. I think I like we did. Nah, I don't think you did. We did, yeah. dog. How? We put you on fucking Griselda. I blatantly remember telling you, like, check these niggas out. No, man. He probably, <laughs> he probably didn't. Probably had to force him to. Probably. Right, right. He just heard the shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. These niggas are <laughs> I remember Kyle, yo man, you ain't fuck with that West Side Gun. I'm like, West Side Gun. He kept coming at me like, yo. Man, what the fuck? I'm thinking it's some young cat from the right. West Coast. Damn, Orlando. Oh, man, I, ain't, I ain't never heard of West Side. Man, you listen, man, they cold. Man, you ain't never heard of Griselda? I'm like, what? Who the coldest one? Griselda member? Benny. Be Beanie. Hands Benny. down. Hands down. I agree. You, oh, you agree with that? Yeah. <laughs> oh, now you agree. You just said Conway. <laughs> no, I'm saying from a... There's a difference between... Oh. It's a fucking... Who, who, you know what I'm saying? Who fucking with Eminem? Does that make him oh. the best? Just from a technical standpoint, there's a difference between who's the best rapper and who's a, the, technically the best rapper. So Conway can, can put words together better than Benny. Is right. Damn. But I want to hear what Benny got to say. LeBron More than Conway. Assists. You feel me? Yeah. Dude, I want to hear a little album of Conway. He had 18 assists. Terrible, terrible segue. We lost. Yeah, horrible segue, but yeah, he just lost. Mm. Magic beat the Lakers. Ice Cube had a triple double. But <laughs> Sonics beat the Super Sonics beat the Lakers. Nah, uh, yeah. Now nah, I'm going with uh, Benny. Yeah. Sure. Benny, was, Benny, he Benny was the the cat at the early shows opening for them. Like, who's this dude? Yeah. Like, Benny, West Westside West. is real like commercial. After I wouldn't what? say commercial. He just he just charismatic as fuck. Yeah, yeah charismatic. You know what I'm saying? Like, he commercial as charismatic. He charismatic. He doesn't have anything on the radio. He'll never have anything on the radio. He won't, but he's the most charismatic. I'm charismatic, radio. yeah. Yeah, they don't. Well, I don't really listen to the radio like they. I don't either. I listen. To they, I'm sure they're they playing them on satellite. Like they, I know they're playing Roddy Rich. I know I, I can hear a Roddy Rich on the GCI. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, You're not gonna hear West Side. They not gonna. They not gonna give you a commercial track like that. Right. That's just not them. You know what I'm saying? That's why I said in the group text, I was saying, you know, saying shout out to to West Side. He. He over in Paris, you know what I'm saying, in Fashion Week, mm -hmm. just being himself. Like, yep. you know what I'm saying? He ain't gotta, like, fucking have a number one hit. Like, you know yep. what I'm saying? He's just that dope. He's just dope. It's mm -hmm. hip hop, you know what I'm saying? Like, I was listening to uh, Big Noid shoot him up on uh, YouTube, and one of the comments was like, yo, this is commercial as Big Noid gonna get. Cause that was probably Big Noise best song, and it was still talking about killing cats. <laughs> right, agree. So that's, that's what you're gonna get from uh, Griselda too. Like they're just gonna be <laughs> themselves, man. Yeah, totally. they ain't gonna give you no track for the ladies. <laughs> they ain't gonna be the commercial right. cookie cutter single. It's, I got it's a, them, man. I got an issue, man. All right, so we're in the podcast game, right? So Are we, we, yeah, we're officially in the podcast game. We coming for these niggas, man. Fucking rap radar ass niggas, <laughs> fucking. Fucking Joe Button, man. I I, I kind of from the podcast aspect. I kind of like y'all niggas know. I I kind of like admire Joe Button. You know? I give it up. Yeah. I give props where it's due. Um, but I see this nigga like on interviews and shit. Like you know what I'm saying? Uh, he talks in the third person. You know what I'm saying? I see. <laughs> 
I seen him on Math Alpha. You know, Math Alpha got a, a, a I, I seen I seen a clip from that when he's talking like, about turn down the money. Yeah, turn down ten million. Yeah. Nigga, what the fuck he do you think? He, oh, he Our said he cap. would. Uh, you know, something like that. I think he said he did. Yeah, he did. They was turning down deals for a while for the podcast. Yeah, salute to him. You yeah. know what I'm saying? All I'm saying, because he kind of like breaking doors for this mm-hmm. podcast shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? He, nobody was getting money off podcasts, so he started like really, yeah. you know what I'm saying? The Spotify deal was unreal. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? That, but, was the fir- that, was, that wasn't the first offer they got. They was getting offers right. before that. Yeah. I was looking at some shit when he had Nicki Minaj on there, mm-hmm. this Math Hoffa. Like, cats giving Joe Button, like, I respect this nigga, I respect Joe Button from the park, but cats giving him, as a rapper, a lot of fucking props. That technically, he's a good rapper. No, no, no. Joe but, Button. But, 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 from the technical aspect, like you were just I was saying. never a, yeah, from the technical aspect. He was the rapper. I was he, never really a Joe Button fan either. I was never... I put him in the um. It's but it's like if I'm gonna go to Joe, but if I'm gonna go to the rapidy rap guy, you know what I'm saying. If I'm gonna go to the spitter, you know what I'm saying. Bars guy. That's Joe Button. I'm gonna go to the echelon. He wasn't at the echelon of this. I'm gonna go to the most deaths. I'm gonna go to the but he's the Tyler Qualies. Pump pump it up. He gets played. No his lot. only pump pump. That's his only commercial hit. That's all he needed. He getting paid off that still. Yeah. yeah. But I'm just saying like Ain't no but like <laughs> No 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 it is a but I'm saying like he You know what I'm saying No 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 real talk Like I'm saying like Like if you listen to Rap Radar He said he didn't He started Did you see that? In math Not Rap Radar Math Hoffa He said he started off thing, He said cause you know It had the whole uh, scenario That uh, 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 uh. You know what I'm saying? He said he heard scenario out of that He was like This is a battle rap Like even that He wouldn't accept like that was a commercial. He said, "I started out with that. That was supposed to be a battle rap." Mm-hmm. Like, nigga, mm-hmm. Cats is talking about this cat in another like dimension of what he really was. Like, you know what I'm saying? Salute to Joe Button. You know what I'm saying? But he, he wasn't come, he cold had like with that, a, nigga. He had to come with a single, right? When that came, and even that failed. I remember watching the VH1. Well, it didn't fail? Uh, no, no, no. I remember watching. It was on VH1. And they, they like docu, it was like a documentary. They showed his, his like opening day mm-hmm. and him crying because <laughs> it, it did like poor sales. He's like on Joe's a crier. Yeah, he's emotional. But he had reason to cry because that shit tanked. <laughs> that fuck, you know what I'm saying? Like, cats, like, he's no Talib Kweli. He's no most deaf. He's no common. Like, the spitter spitters. Like, you know, I'm going to go to the upper right. echelon of spitters. We don't say that is, go. But y'all respect him as a battle rapper, right? I'm gonna go to niggas within his own group. I'll fuck with Royce the Five Nine before I fuck with, with with Joe Button. Joe Button, I fuck with. Don't get me wrong. You know what I'm saying? That Rage Against the Machine, that shit was cold. That was probably the only Joe, first Joe Button ever listened to all the way. Yeah, that shit was cold. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But it's cats within his own group that I fuck with before him. You know what I'm saying? Like that. Royce is probably the only one for me. I never, Royce, was, I never was big on Joel Ortiz or Chris. Joel had a dope album. Uh, Recently? Do, yo, 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 do me a favor, Duke. Accidentally step on your white sunglasses. Like that, <laughs> <laughs> that, that album. You know what I'm saying? He dropped a mixtape like maybe last year or so. Yeah, I saw it. Yeah. With, uh, Crooked Eye, the only one Apollo that. Apollo Brown, I think it was. Yeah, with Apollo Brown. Yeah, right? I like that. Mm-hmm. Well, his stuff before that, I never really got into it with uh, Joel. I'm just Crooked saying. Eye, I was never really into. With that being said, I mean to sit on Joe Budden, <laughs> the podcaster, the rapper, nah, you know. I respect him as a rapper. Yeah. What else should I got, man? So if Joe Budden died, you think people ain't going to say he top five? No. You and that was about that, that list. That, that list that came out, he was what, top ten or some shit? Like, Joe Budden? I mean, oh, man, the, uh, man, uh, that shit went viral. Yeah, the most recent one. Yeah, he, I think he was top three on there. <laughs> he, was top, <laughs> well, he was top three? <laughs> on that recent list there. It was like Jay Nas, Joe Budden, though. <laughs> Jay Nas and Joe Budden. Whatever podcast they was that dropped that list. Remember we used to tear you know what? I'm, I'm not an old cat. But like, I feel like the old cats, like the Rock Hems and the LL Cool J's and the Big Daddy Kane's, don't get enough. They don't get enough props. Like, they definitely should be in your top twenty. 
Like, because they paved... I hate to be cliche, but they oh, did shit. pave the way. Yeah, true. They did pave the way for the, the, the Nas's and the, and the hoes. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm-hmm. like LL should definitely be in your top 20. Anyone's top 20. Yeah. Like, if you listen to LL, he was definitely before his time. He reinvented yeah. himself Man. a couple times, yeah. Mm-hmm. If you, he, he defeated cannabis. You know what I'm saying? 99% of your fans <laughs> don't exist. Oh, yeah. All right. What'd you call it? Um, um, Big Daddy Kane should definitely be, but you know what I'm saying? Like, I say all that to say, like, everyone's top 25, top 50, or everyone's list, so to speak, I think it's skewed. Like, they don't look at the, um, the older rappers and they don't get it's all subjective right, yeah. right, right, right it is subjective but like you definitely have to see like in basketball we have to look at the Will Chamberlain and the Kareem like I didn't see I didn't I didn't see Will play but like I gotta put him up there cause his stats are actually stats that that shit, right. so so a young motherfucker may say yo I didn't listen to LL but I gotta respect him this motherfucker got he you know he's still on TV to this day and got no stash so he must have did something right <laughs> You know what I'm saying? So So you put Bill Russell up there too? Yeah, Bill Russell is definitely in, in your NBA he definitely should I don't be think a top. he averaged twenty points though. It doesn't matter. He averaged twenty rebounds. Yeah. Which is hard as fuck. <laughs> he was playing against bums. Doesn't matter. So he played Will so Chamberlain play, like six times play a week. In competition. He played Will Chamberlain like like five, six Besides times. Him, he played though. the great one of the greatest. So why players. would you put L L in your top twenty? He didn't How have any classic record. albums he got. Walk Like a Panther was, was yeah. critically acclaimed. Radio. He doesn't have a lot of classic. He got classic Phenomenal. hits, though. Oh, yeah, definitely. He, he got, got classic, classic hits. Yeah. And, he, and, he, and he has a, uh, a bona fide rap battle with a couple of people. Kumo yeah. D. Kumo D. Legendary. Legendary Kumo D. And, uh, and uh, Cannabis. Cannabis. And who else? Yeah. Ice-T. Ice-T. I think he low-key went out with Park too. Ah. <gasps> Speak on it. I think I think I remember seeing something about him, Pac and LL having beef. Hmm. I don't think Pac ever named him in a verse or nothing, but I, I think they had beef. I think I remember reading that somewhere. I don't know. Real quick, uh, Nipsey Russell was not a legend. Nipsey Russell, Nipsey Russell, I said Nipsey Russell. I said Nipsey Russell. From the Wiz. <laughs> Nipsey Hussle was not a legend, man. Maybe from a philanthropist, philanthropist. <laughs> whatever. Am I saying that right? <laughs> Philan, philanthropist. Yo, Mike, he was a good, he was a good dude. <laughs> oh, I keep it, man. Like maybe from as a philanthropist, maybe he was a good dude, man. He did a lot of shit for the hood, but his music. I, it's a reason that he just he dropped a million mixtapes before his first like official album. Like you know what I'm saying? Like if it, musically, he I was think he was turning legend. down deals. Was that is that the reason? I think so. I was I never think like Ross over was the trying top. to sign him. For real? Yeah. I was never over the top with his music. I I liked his uh, what was the first single? Hustle in the house. I liked that, but he was he never really. Shot up with with the label deal and all that. He just kept dropping mixtapes, staying low. Okay. I always thought he was a decent rapper, though. It was always decent. Yeah, yeah. Was decent but Cass put that you, legend every, tag. Yeah, on. everything. When you, you know die, you know. When you die, die. Dead rappers get better promotion. Yeah. I probably go crazy. Yeah. Right. Yeah. yeah. Unfortunately, that's that's, that's, that's how, how it, it is. is. Yeah. I totally agree with that. I think like when you pass, it just goes up. I. I Quiet as kept. If you want to be funky fresh, like a lot of people prior to his death didn't know who he was. That's true. <laughs> we knew because we follow funky. Yeah, yeah but was, like but a lot of people didn't know his music, but like once he passed, I don't think like, they knew of him. He was, he was on Double XL Freshman Carol. I don't nah, know. know who he is. His actual murder went viral. Yeah. So yeah. motherfuckers gonna see. I hear about Nipsey Hussle that never knew shit about his music. Mm-hmm. Right. You know what I'm saying? I don't think my girl knew who Nipsey Hussle was mm. until he died. Right. Right. The average the average fan probably didn't know. Nah. It's it's unfortunate. If you you know if you wanna that's, that's how it is, man. If you wanna approach us, then dead ass like <laughs> sure, right, right. Sure. <laughs> you didn't know about <laughs> Nipsey Hussle <laughs> his death or like, you know, West Coast probably did. Though. Yeah, West Coast cats. Oh I'm yeah, talking, West Coast. I'm talking did. about like Bay Area. People in our in Midwest. Nah, probably it's, it's a few. Nah, not you know a lot of people didn't know about this. Yeah, right. I don't think a lot of people. Know. 
Um, what else you got, man? Yo, I'm just happy that we able to get together. You know, as friends, we known each other for some some eons. Right. Yo, <laughs> mad, mad John of Mad John of But yo, like. Yeah, it's good to get the pod back up. It's good, it's good to get the pod up because yeah, like, everyone's doing it. Yo, I don't, I don't, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't, you know, I've been broke my whole life. I don't need this for fame. <laughs> I don't need this for clout. You know what I'm saying? I don't care it's about expression. it. expression. Yeah, it's just expression. Like, like I know these two cats, like, and I think that these two dudes know about music and basketball slash but No, nah, basketball, fuck it. Like, y'all ninjas. So basketball, y'all don't know about football, baseball, but I think <laughs> who doesn't know about football? Isaiah, Z. Oh, oh, yeah, I said, yeah. But like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm just glad we able to get together and like put it out there. Like, if y'all like it, cool. If y'all don't, we'll work on it. But all in all, like, we just getting, we just some broke motherfuckers getting together and just talking shit, and swallowing the spit. You know what I'm saying? No homo. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, and just drinking like. Y'all would do on everyday basis. Like we talk about this shit on a daily basis via group text, you know yeah. what I'm saying? So without the cameras, it's without the cameras, it's like you know what I'm saying? Like it's just fun and just whatever. Like we just talk about shit that we see on TV just like y'all do. So this is cool. Like my man Joe, like he brought us together, you know what I'm saying, no homo. You know what I'm saying? We form like Voltron. We form like yeah. Voltron. Form, form like the Wu-Tang. Yeah, except we missing like six other members. There's only three of us. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But um, we got many more episodes. I, I got so much shit, man. I got so... Yeah, I know these niggas do, man. We got so much. Yeah, but... I mean, it'll come. Pause. Woo. You know what I'm saying? But... No. Bear, bear with us. We in the embryonic stages. <laughs> Sports life and hip hop. Once again, any comments, any props, any disses, any topics you want us to uh, to touch on, just throw them down there in the comments. You know what I'm saying? Either that or S L H H P O D S L H H P O D at on I G or S L H H P O D on uh, at Gmail. Once again, this is my man Zeke. It's Ricky Shui. We do this for y'all, man. Channel 7. Fuck with us. <laughs>